today you want to talk about paint. We do lots of different types, or even if you buy paint anywhere, you'll need to know some common things uh, about the product. So for that, no need to use what you call a technical data sheet. You look for information on it. A lot of questions you need to know will be similar. How quick can the paint dry? What surface can I put it on? All that type of stuff. So for that, we will refer to a technical data sheet. So I'm going to spend a little bit of time just going through the sheet and explaining the different processes. Okay, we've laid out a selection of products here. We're concentrating mostly on Bisa and Pelini. But if you know how to use these products, it'll go for the same no matter what the brand of paint you're using. So, first of all, with some products, they're two pack, which means you have one part, which say could be the paint, the other part is the hardener, the other part is the thinners. You have a thing referring to ratios, so you need to know how much to add in. For that, we would use mixing stick. We have um, plastic containers which are calibrated on the side so you can look at the ratios that way. Um, okay, so to concentrate on the, the data sheet, at the start you see it has applications. So it's asking you what you want to apply the paint to or what can you apply that particular paint to. So it's very important to read that section. It'll tell you about um, drying times. It'll tell you about how to mix the paint if it needs to be mixed with tears or hardener. Um, again, whether it can be applied by brush or roller or whether it has to be sprayed on. Okay, that was a quick look at technical data sheets. Um, as I say, it's well worth looking at the technical data sheet. Don't be daunted by it. Um, it's worth spending a few minutes flicking through whether you have to paint it ourselves or elsewhere. It's good practice just to do that. Because if you don't follow the instructions, you can end up in trouble and you can waste a lot of money and time. So please feel free to contact ourselves at vinnyborn.com, uh, sales at vinnyborn.com, or ring us, uh, and we're going to be too glad to help you.